Well guys, seems like the ACC is planning to relax some of the requirements for certain hedge funds. This is not a good news guys and Nasdaq also agrees with this. As you can see over here, they created a special article saying that this is not a good idea. The ACC must not relax reporting requirements for hedge funds. Here is why. So the current proposal from the ACC wants to raise the reporting threshold triggering reporting requirements to 3.5 billion dollars from 100 million dollars. They, they simply could do whatever they want. Nobody wants to know what they're doing. Look at this. SEC claims that this change would reduce the burdens on smaller managers. Why, why, why? According to the SEC, easing the reporting requirements would help small managers reducing their cost and preventing larger competitors from gaining insight into their strategies. Wow, we're worrying about the rich, wealthy, very, very powerful institutional investors on the stock market. And I mean, guys, from, from the point of view of individual investor, things are already very messy. Sometimes they proposed more requirements and more transparency. And the next time they just propose reducing the requirements and reducing the reporting data. Crazy. Look at this. A deeper look at the existing SEC regulator reveals that the proposed changes would reduce transparency. Reduced transparency without meaningfully reducing regulatory burdens. In other words, the subject doesn't matter. Something else matters, obviously. It's like you are selling potatoes on the market and you're telling me that you're not selling the potatoes for the money, you're selling the potatoes for the potatoes themselves. In the article from Nasdaq, you can see why they bring back the history since 2019 when SEC began to require funds to report these new changes in 13F filings. As you can see, they are obligated to report changes in their derivatives, bonds, assets backed securities loans currencies and even swaps something that archegos knows very well about so funds must file these reports on the monthly basis so every month you have update on these changes so this is why all of these hundred million dollars under management uh, hedge funds are you know uh, level level up with other ones otherwise we don't know how the the family offices have been under regulated and still under regulated in comparison with the big hedge funds and we saw what happened with the smaller family offices they created the archegos and archegos created the the current credit suisse so this is why this is a huge mistake guys also something very interesting was point out in the article is that without having this information up to date in other words if the small hedge funds lose this requirement for reporting you know you don't have this every month report what they have done how they traded their derivatives, what, are, what is their exposure, you know, is there any change on the margin, uh, what is the, the ratio between long short, uh, what is the potential systematic risk coming from their own portfolio or their counterparties. You don't have none of this because this uh, proposal will change the threshold to billions of dollars versus a hundred million dollars. And this is exactly how the article ends. As you can see over here, the SEC should actually raise transparency and uh, should focus more on finding the ways to reduce the systematic risk otherwise the article is saying that SC should face criticism for protecting Wall Street uh, I think guys this is very very true leave your thoughts in the comment section guys subscribe to the channel like this video and come back for more yeah.